hello guys so in today's video i will be showing you guys how i dye my hair i've been very bored at home so i figured i can do that and i've been wearing my hair in a hat for most of the quarantine life but let me show you guys what i am working with hello guys in today's video i will be showing you guys how i dye my hair this is my hair currently let me show you guys i have a tangle right here sorry like right there and it is very very um como se dice And it is very frizzy right now because I had it in a hat. But let me show you guys. These are the hair extensions that I bought. And they are black. And you can see right there the color difference. So I'm going to try to match it to my hair extensions so I will be dyeing my hair so I'll see you guys when I am done I'm going to speed this video so it's not too boring and I'll see you guys when I'm done I'm going to part the hair in four sections first in two then this section I like to go from my ear back and part it, go straight from the ear, all as straight as you can make it, go like that, and I don't know why but I always start at the bottom, so I will start with these, so I am mostly going to focus on the ends, not so much on the whole entire head, so just mostly on the ends. So I will be doing this all along the hair. And then I'll show you guys when I'm done. So I am all done and I'm going to put this little cap on my hair just for probably 20 minutes because I don't want it super super black I just want it to hide the brown that I have so I'm just going to leave it for like 20-30 minutes and then I'll take a shower and then I'll come right back so I'll see you guys a little bit later. hello guys today is tuesday and today i went we went to walmart and i bought me another shelf of these because it goes really well with my desk and i was really excited but as you guys can see i have this one right here but i plan on putting this one down here so that is my little project for today i'm going to zoom you guys in because it's really far out and I am ambidextrous <laughs> I can use both hands equally let me try it out I pushed it in too much So this is how it looks right now and I actually really like it but I was going to try, where is 
to a let me go get the level okay so i ended up putting the shelf right there and i think it looks really nice actually give you one second i think it looks really pretty actually so i am going to put my nail polishes right there i am expanding i've been buying a lot of new stuff so i have um a lot of inventory nail inventory stuff but i'm going to put my nail polishes over here and see how that looks because i really like it so let me see how that looks okay so this is the finished product this is how it looks with the two shelves and i love it i think it looks better now over here i just have my diploma my certificate and then these nail polishes and i freed this whole um, shelf right here which is good because all of these were crammed up here so i am going to i am going to reorganize all of this and then i'll show you guys how it looks at the end these i'm going to put in a numerical order i like them like this so get started guys so i am taking a little break because oh i had my hair on behind my ear like this and it made a crease right there oh i hate it <laughs> anyway i'll just tuck it in um i'm taking a little break because i'm a little bit uh, tired and i i'm hungry as well so i prepared myself a little bit of some lunch a quick lunch right here as you guys can see I just have a sandwich right here and I like this kind of bread that they have at Walmart then I have chips with lemon and Valentina in my water right there so let me show you guys I was going to show you guys these are the nail polishes these nail polishes right here the gel bottle and these are these so I am really happy because they have a lot of colors as you guys can see right here but let me show you guys they are $19 each unfortunately they're really really expensive and that's not it these ones down here let's continue on with the colors these ones right here these which are the nudes and they are the pretty ones these are actually 21 dollars you guys can see right there so I was thinking of putting in an order because I only have 12 of them and I am lacking some colors. So I am going to see how many I end up liking and see how many I can afford because they are pretty expensive as you guys saw. So I'm going to see how many I like and then I'll show you guys what I end up buying. So I'll see you guys a little bit later. So I am done finally cleaning my area and this is how it ended up looking. 
this one right here is just all clean this is my little practice area that's where I put my silicone hand and that is my little lamp for practicing this is just a little dust collector that my husband is working on he wanted to make it more powerful than this one so he's building me my own over here I have all of my nail polishes these are the stamping polishes and just like that right here I just have nail pins and my barbicide right here I ended up just keeping the essentials that I need and over here this is how it looks I really ended up liking how this looks I just left all my airbrush paints in there my airbrush and then my gel bottle polishes right there which I will be collecting more soon and then right here I kept it very minimal down here I have regular nail polishes just in case those are great for stamping as well so right here and then this is my area my dust collector one of my lamps and another lamp over here I have all of my colored acrylics my collections and then right here I kept it very minimal so I just left it like that so yeah this is how it turned out I hope you guys like it right now I am going to practice so I will see you guys in a little bit.